dreamstime.com audio. Hello everyone, I'm Akash from IIT Kanpur, first year MTech student. I got uh, GATE All India Rank 32 in uh, 2022. And today we are here with us a special guest, AR17 from this year's GATE Aerospace. That too from a non-aerospace background, come on, it's not a joke. <laughs> so, welcome Anish, how are you? Hi, I am fine, I'm doing great, relatively. Yeah. So introduce was introduce yourself for us. Yeah, I'm I'm, I'm Anish. I'm Anish. I live in Kolkata, West Bengal. I'm currently finishing my uh, BTech course in instrumentation engineering from the University of Calcutta. I'll pro I'll pass out by June, and I got TIR seventeen. I guess, and I'm pretty interested in the aerospace that the aerospace sector. So that's why I give gate. Yeah. So, what were your raw emotions when you saw your rank AR-17? Did you always expect it? That you, did you know you did well? No, I actually, I did not expect uh, the rank to come up this good. I felt, I felt fine. I wasn't, I felt fine. I felt, it was very satisfactory. I, it was After nice. This long, yeah. So, so when did you actually start your preparation? Like I started my preparation. I started it around uh, like I joined the Feb batch of talking to Mr. Okay. Dinesh. So, but uh, I started to increase my efforts towards this from around April, April, May, June, around that time. Yeah, I think usually it goes like that only in Feb and all. It will be like slightly slow. Yeah, yes. that is, exactly. Uh, so, but uh, when did you plan on giving it? When was the first thing like? When did this come to your head that you need to give gate in aerospace? Like I have always been interested about rockets and planes ever since I, you know, yeah, tried yes. making them with Legos and stuff. So during the pandemic, I had a lot of free time. I came across this very nice simulation game called Kerbal Space Program, where you get to make, oh. make rockets and planes according to real life uh, calculations and stuff. So I wanted to understand that more and then I started reading the books, reading the actual books like Rocket Propulsion Elements and J.D. Anderson's books. And from oh, there I started nice. to grow a big interest in it. And I was thinking how could I, like, how can I dive even deeper? I came across Gate, obviously I looked at Gate's uh, syllabus and I was like, you know, this is pretty doable. It'd be pretty fun knowing about all this. And maybe I should give a go for, go at this. I might have a shot at this. I think we all start off by reading uh, JD Anderson. <laughs> yeah, we probably all start off from doing that. Yeah, so then... So IGC, so how did IGC actually help you reach your goal? IGC, like... like aerospace is totally new for you, right? IGC would have done a great help. Yeah, they've, they've, they've done a great help. Like the teachers, the lecturers in the faculty from IGC, they're very knowledgeable and very, very good lecturers. Like Mr. Dinesh, Mr. Akshay, Mr. Rahul, Mr. Nitin, Mr. Shambhu. And to name a few of them, they were like absolutely yeah. very good teachers. And they paced the, like, they structured the whole course so well. Like they progressed from easier concepts to a little more complex concepts and they paced out the lectures so well, it was very, it, it made it a lot more easier to understand and they gave us very good book recommendations, they had the books, they gave us the books and they gave us a lot of materials, a lot of compiled materials that we could solve and on top of that we had WhatsApp groups for like every subject. Every to every every topic, every major topic, we had WhatsApp groups for that, where we had our doubts cleared. And uh, Mr. Dinesh talked to us almost like every month to see how much we're progressing. And you that can directly contact them, right? Through yeah, we could directly contact them. them. They were very, 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 very readily available. Mm. Yeah, yeah, I agree. And uh, how were the like exams and stuff? Did you yeah, start mocks. giving your exam? Yeah, the mocks. The, the mocks. The mocks, I uh, started giving it regularly after, you know, like reading a topic, 
and then uh, okay. Mr. Dinesh always emphasized on giving the mocks and of course when it's I started giving, yeah I started giving the mocks I could evaluate how much I learned and you know when you even when you start like actually like from a beginner's perspective when you like realize how a turbojet kind of works and you solve sums, you understand that you can solve those sums, it's kind of a euphoric feeling and then you go into the exams and then you evaluate yourself and it's a very fun, sometimes you panic but then it's a very very fun process yeah, yeah. at the end of the day. Aerospace is a very nice branch to get into, right? Yeah, it's exactly. It's very exciting. It's very exciting. That's what uh, got me into aerospace also. Exactly. So then how did you manage your fourth year? Like you did it along with your fourth year, right? Yes, it yes, I did. Would have been pretty hard, right? Yeah, I was actually pretty busy throughout the whole uh, year. Like, I really had to hone my time-solving skills. I, I wasn't the best, you know, like the most organized person. But I had to organize my life because, like, there were things that I wanted. Mm -hmm. Like, I had my final year, uh, final year. I had my NSEMs. I had my final year projects to work with. I had a mandatory internship which I had to do. I also was working in the small part-time job and then after all this like I always kept a you know, chaotic schedule but a schedule and I tried to stick to that. I I thought about things that I have to do, things that I have to revise, things that I have to study and the regular classes which IGC provided that obviously injected yeah. that regularness into the schedule and I'm very grateful for that. The structure of classes are nice right? Like. They don't load you too much also and they don't like, exactly. it keeps you in, in the game. Yeah, it keeps you in the game. It keeps you engaged with the whole uh, thing and then you read the books also yeah. and it's a very fun experience. So, then how would, how did you like, like spend your, like how did you allocate your time? Like how much hours did you spend on gate? On gate, like it was, it, it was, it was a progressive effort like to around May, April I focused on doing the classes and maybe around one hours of revision here and there maybe trying to solve the sums well like when mr dinesh started the structures i tried to solve the sums and then i realized that i don't know about this so i'll probably have to wait for the next class and then you know it's a progressive effort and uh, i guess around june july august september around september i started devoting more hours three hours three to four or five hours and then it kept increasing it kept increasing because i realized gate was coming i can't just be blown away by how interesting the subject is i need to attempt gate two and uh, i kept going I, I tried to better myself in a sense did you have final exam for the last year or was it like just was there no exam for you in the final semester? No, I had I had I had NSEMs. I had my seven semester NSEMs and my eight semester NSEMs are currently gonna happen around May. Oh. So yeah, I had my NSEMs in December along with my final year project, uh, the first semester, the seventh, second last semester part of it. So I had all that going on too. So I but I managed my time. You know, I realized that I can't really waste a lot of my remain remaining time. Mm -hmm. I, but you I didn't set up priorities, right? Yeah, uh, but I didn't, you know, like ex I lose my mind or like panic over it. I still, you know, I went out on yeah. jogs, met met up with my friends, and my friends were obviously I had I had very good friends who motivated me, kept me up. Yeah, motivation can be a big issue while preparing. So how did you keep yourself motivated along this whole journey? Uh, like apart from enjoying what I was studying, I I consumed quite a bit of aerospace media. Like, uh, like watching an ISRO or a SpaceX launch or something or like uh, watching The Expanse. It's a TV show on space uh, and yeah, watching yeah. one of those episodes was enough to, you know, I didn't get carried away with it, but it was enough to motivate me to study and get back into the game and everything. And obviously, Mr. Dinesh, he provided regular, regular uh, motivation for us. And at the same time... Yeah. And at the same time, my parents, my friends, they were also very motivating. Yeah, nice. Did you, uh, you didn't like watch any like motivational videos at all? Uh, I, because I think people do that. Yeah, sure. You can watch motivational videos and stuff. But I thought, you know, just, you know, I uh, listened to Mr. Dinesh and I tried to stick to the basics because I think I like, I am not like the absolute model student or anything 
of that sort but i just think you know just sticking to the basics trying to make a schedule writing down your short notes when you're in class trying to get your doubts cleared solving some sums reading up the books just doing the doing that stuff itself and you know trying to better trying to improve yourself i think that should go a long way yeah yeah i agree and uh, how did you deal with distractions like along this whole year you would have had like a lot of distractions right how yeah. did you deal with the distractions that's a good question i uh, dealt with distractions in the sense i again time managed it like i knew that i would get distracted for these many hours so you kept some time for distraction right for distractions yes and i normally i just distracted myself by looking at aerospace media itself like i'm watching an air crash documentary or something like that which would again makes me think about what i'm going to study in a few minutes yeah so share some tips for gate 24 24 students what do you think they should be doing i think first of all you should reevaluate like what you want to do and what exactly works for you maybe like how do you want to study how do you want to make a schedule i think making a schedule is a very basic fact that you need to do that and uh, but you got to think about what are your goals why why do you want to give this exam what, what motivates you to study how do you want to study what works for you and what kind of distractions you want to keep to so you i think you need to think about all of that and then you need to be interested in what you're studying at the same time you need to realize that gate is an exam but it's an important one you shouldn't lose your mind over it not panic over it but yeah. i mean yeah, sometimes yeah. i panicked everybody panics and but uh, you know you keep striving to do something and you know you keep putting in the work putting in the hours and stuff i think that should be good enough and listening to your professors cuz yeah. they really know a yeah, lot yeah that's that's good yeah yeah uh, how was your last two months of gate preparation like what was your literal schedule for last two months like for me i it was still, super important right yeah it was i i was actually panicking over that last two months of my gate schedule cuz uh, obviously it's very crucial but i had my nsems and my final year projects and stuff so i i thought about all that i had to work around it again time management i wrote those short notes and those short notes were very crucial again they were very yeah. crucial cuz that and uh, the remaining time that i had i knew i couldn't like waste it away especially during that last two months and uh, igc provides a host a huge number of mock tests to act, to help you deal with any exam pressure and stuff and i really benefited from that did you write the mock test every week like the weekly tests i tried to write every mock test during that three during that 250 233 uh three maybe four by like very latest during that gate timing like exactly when the window opens i tried to write it and maybe if i didn't i missed it the next day around three like i uh, regularly wrote every mock test especially the final mock test the full mock yeah. tests those last uh, yeah yeah because i realized yeah. i i am someone who would panic during the exams and it did happen <laughs> but these uh, these exams really helped me with it and uh, right before the exam how were you calm like how were you like meant carrying yourself right before the exam i i just listened to music and uh, i was trying to distract myself but at the same time keep my head there yeah. and just maybe think about a few formulas like and also i uh, always took morning runs morning jogs and drank a lot of water i think they really calm you down um uh, and yeah I think you can do that stuff. It will help you. Yes. So let's end this by telling, like, how did IGC help you overall? Like, as as a person, how did it develop you? IGC, I mean, uh, would have developed you, right? Yeah, as a like as an aerospace engineer, they did a lot. Like, I'm really grateful to Mr. Dinesh and the host of faculty for supporting us for teaching us. I'm really really grateful like every class I went into I felt like I was going to learn something new and uh, it, it was a very very enjoyable experience I don't think I've like 
maybe this is personal but i don't think i've ever had this much fun studying a subject before new subjects are somewhat very fun to study right and then new... aerospace is even more interesting Aerospace is even more interesting. That's it. Like I, I like I'm literally playing these simulation games, and you know I'm calcul. I'm using the formulas that I learnt in class to play them, and it it was very fun. And then I can, it's cal the calculations and you know understanding how how those turbo jets work and the turbo fans. It's it's a very euphoric experience. Experience for the viewers. Uh, tell us about your game, like you are talking about. No, let the viewers yeah. know what this game it is. Uh, yeah, it's called Kerbal Space Program. Uh, they actually got out the second version of that too. So basically, it's okay. like this universe sandbox. There's an analog of the whole solar system. You can make rockets, and then it follows like orbital mechanics. You can send them to other planets, and then land them. and then collect signs and it um, it obviously incorporates real life physics into it like you, you need to think about the isp values of your rockets and stuff and it's very interesting it's very interesting nice so we don't want to change anything about the journey if you were allowed to go back in time and you have to make, improve on anything would you like I think maybe I could have given a little more effort. Maybe I could, I should have solved maybe a few more aptitude questions because uh, the aptitude questions are very important. I did. Lose yeah, a that's a difference maker. That's a difference maker. Yeah, and uh, but apart from that, I think I had a very fulfilling experience with IGC ex especially. Like I actually joined IGC after watching an interview. IGC conducted with Mr. Manoj Bhaiya, who was also from a different department, and and I checked up IGCs uh, how how they work, and I realized it was very 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 good. And I hey, which year interview was this? I think twenty twenty one or twenty twenty. I think twenty twenty. Oh, I saw the same thing there. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I was not in seeing the same thing. Yeah, nice. it was a very convincing interview. Yeah, 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 I agree. Uh, so then, if you're joining IIT Kanpur, I welcome you. Okay, you can always come and ask me anything. Sure, 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 sure. It'll be nice to meet you. Okay. Yeah, that's fine. So let's end this meeting, guys. Thank you for watching. Thank you. And if you want to join I I G C, you can join. It's a pretty good coaching center. So we would both recommend it. Yeah. We both recommend it. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. Thank you, Anish. Thank Bye. you. All, all the best for your future. Thank you. You too.